Hey guys, what's up? It's Raven, and we are back for another Target vlog. You guys actually really liked it. Last time I took you guys along with me to Target just for some casual shopping. Target is my happy place. I like to just go there for fun and also when I actually really do need something. Today I actually really do need something. Well, Zaya needs some new clothes. Can you imagine? Zaya actually needs new clothes now. She has had an abundance of clothes ever since her um, baby shower. She got a lot of clothes for her baby shower and then you know, more clothes were trickling in as gifts after that. And then of course I was going crazy in all the baby stores getting her clothes. So up until now she has had way too many clothes, but now she's gonna be turning one pretty soon. What you looking at? She's looking at her toy that's down on the floor. My apartment is in shambles. Um, yeah, this is kind of like the aftermath of Zaya playing plus me trying to film in here. It's just, just ignore that. Um, but yeah, she's gonna be turning one really soon. She's almost 11 months old. Her birthday is April 7th. So she's getting to be in that one year size and she doesn't really have that many one year size clothes. All her clothes are mainly um, like nine month size and she's starting to grow out of those. So she actually does need some more one year, 12 month size clothes and then you know the next size up after that so that's what we're mostly going to be on the hunt for today in target i love target's baby clothes especially the um the cat and jack brand i really like so we're gonna go there and then if we don't hit the jackpot at target um then we might also go to like babies r us or carters or something but we're gonna start with target first when you get down zaya has definitely got to the stage now where she's like i can get down and move on my own girl just put me down and let me do it. Yep. 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 So yeah, we're gonna start with Target first and then if not, we might go to a couple other places, but mainly Target. I am just wearing this little crop top from Lola Chutique. These black high-waisted distressed jeans which are from Fashion Nova. And I just threw on my little gold Birkenstock sandals, which are also from Lola Chutique, but they're super, super old. I actually need to look for some new, like, comfy shoes or sandals like that at Target today, too. And I also just need a few more little random things. So I actually do have a little bit of a list going. Don't mind my hair. This is second day hair. Now she's saying up, up, up. That's her new favorite thing to say is up. Now she wants me to pick her up. So yeah, we go between up and down all day long now. It's either up or down. So, um, yeah, let's go to Target. So I don't think I told you guys, but I had a rental car for a while because I had to take my car to the shop because in my parking garage, it's a very tight, tight little space to get out of my parking garage in my apartment so what happened was there's like this big old like i don't even know why they have it set up like this i guess it was like they had no choice with the architecture or something but like there's this support beam like right there right by the the gate where you have to turn so it gives you like three inches to to miss it but if you're in a bigger car like me like an suv like mine and I don't even know if you were in like a suburban or something. I don't even know if you would be able to fit, honestly. But I do it all the time, no problem. But then there was one day, I guess I got a little bit overconfident, you know, just being like, oh, I do this all the time, I got this. And I scraped my passenger side rear door on the little support beam thing. Because it's not just support beam, it's a, it's a support beam with like a little, extra piece of metal around it to be like hey there's a support beam right here and i'm like we see the support beam you don't need to make it bigger by adding an extra bumper thing around it because now you're just giving us even less space to get around it and they like painted it yellow and everything to be like caution don't bump into this i didn't like hit it i just like scraped, like scraped the side of my car against it hard enough not like to where it did anything to me or anything like it just made a scraping noise but it was hard enough to do some damage you know just pay for it got it fixed and it looks brand new so it's cool but yeah other than that i mean driving is pretty normal for me i pretty much 
can go anywhere I want to go. I don't really, I don't go downtown. I don't go any, I don't go out of town or anything like that. So it's not a big deal. It's been completely fine. And I guess if you guys want me to do a separate video, just like about driving and learning how to drive and not wanting to drive and being very scared to drive and having anxiety about it and getting your license late or, you know, not having a license but everybody else has it and finally getting over it. If you guys want a video all about that, I can do one. Just let me know in the comments down below. All ready to go with my car cover. Are you ready, Zaya? And I always use reusable bags to be eco-friendly. Let's go, yay, Target! like to look at the holiday stuff like Easter Valentine's Day because sometimes you can use it for like kids rooms like I think these are supposed to be like for Easter but this would be a really cute little toy basket or trash can for like a kids room oh yeah get it girl Kitty girl, kitty girl. Oh, really cute for an Easter egg hunt. Especially these little containers and stuff. I mean, you don't have to just use it for Easter. These are only three dollars. They have pink and white. Look at this. So I think we decided last time that you are officially out of the baby sizes. No more Cat and Jack baby. Oh, but these are so cute. Maybe just one more look at the baby side. Maybe they have 12 months over here. I'm not totally sure. Mm. None of this is really that cute though. Very springtime Easter, but I don't really like the frilly frou frou stuff. Do you like frilly frou frou stuff? You want to do it? I do still really want these shoes. They do not go up to 12 months. And they have these too. Oh my gosh. But they do not go up to her size. Six to nine months is the biggest size that they have, I think, in both of these. Up, up, up. Pretty big. I see you, boo boo. You like that?
It's past your bedtime. It's past your bedtime. Past your. Get it. Get it. Oh, God. Milkshakes are better with mommy. Oh. Piggies and milkshakes. Look, Zaya, Shimmer and Shine. Shimmer and Shine is actually the inspiration for her genie themed birthday party. But I don't really like character clothes. this little hat I'm gonna wait to get swim stuff later though oh but wait look at this little head wrap I think I have to get this and you need diapers actually Huggies. That's what you wear. Do you need any more bows? Not really. Although you do tend to lose a lot of them all the time. And you don't have this set. I think you need this set. Don't have this set either. Okay, so I charged my camera. Zaya did not take the rest of her nap, but that's okay, I guess. We got two big bags to go through. This is gonna be a, a raw and real haul. You guys can see how loud and active Zaya really is these days. Careful. Now let's turn that off, because we're not gonna be able to hear mommy. 
So hopefully you're at least somewhat able to like see what I got, but you know, you know. Okay, so let's start with Target. I know this is not a Target bag, this is just my reusable bag. We got a lot of stuff actually. I spent like $200, so a good amount of stuff. And I have my viewfinder up, by the way, so I can look at Zara behind me. But the couple of random things that I got for myself at Target are just some um, cotton oval things, oversized cotton rounds. And then I did get two more pairs of lashes, which I just bought lashes at my grocery store like yesterday. But I didn't see these two styles at my grocery store. These are the Ardell Double Up Wispies. So I love the Wispies, these are just the double up version. And then I got these number 600 Wispies, which are just like super PC and chunky. And then the other thing that I got for myself at Target are just these little um, chanclas, I don't know what you would call these. Like They're like little, a mix between a sandal and a flat. They're very Mexican inspired diet. What are you doing? Hi. What? But yeah, they're kind of like a mix between a sandal and a flat. I'm really late to this trend. They were really popular, like, they've been popular. I mean, they've been popular, like, traditionally, but in terms of, like, modern fashion or whatever, they've been popular for a while. I just didn't think they would look good on me, but I was like, I need an easy shoe that I can put on without having, like, I need to be able to just slip it on my foot without having to use my hands, but still look like I'm not wearing slides or slippers. So, I got these, and they actually do look pretty cute on, and they're actually very comfortable because they've got that, like, kind of bendable leather material. And yeah, they were $24.99 and they fit really well and they're really comfortable and I can put them on without using my hands. So these are the perfect mom shoe for warm weather. Next, I'm gonna go through the shoes and accessories that I got for Zaya. The first little accessory that I picked up are these pair of fuzzy white bunny ears. They were a dollar in the little dollar holiday section in the front of the store and I plan on using these to take pictures of her for Easter of course because I like to take pictures for every holiday in general but also to post on her Instagram page so I want to do like some cute little Easter bunny pictures of her as I don't touch that then I got three little headband things the first one is just this one head wrap by Cat and Jack. This is one that I think you can wrap around multiple times and get more of like a head wrap type of look. And it has like kiwi, watermelon, banana, cherry. So it's like a tropical fruit theme. And these are more like two or three dollars for the whole pack. And so she already has a pack of these in purple and hot pink, but then today they had the gray and light pink. And she always wears these colors, so she doesn't need, but I wanted to say she needs these headbands and they stay on her head really good. And then these, she doesn't have any of these yet. These have like little rhinestones sewn on. So it's good that they're sewn on and not glued on so they won't just like pop off and she won't like choke on it or something. But they are sewn on to the headbands on a couple of them. And it's got light pink, mint, blue, purple, and hot pink. So then I got her two pairs of shoes from Target. The first pair are these little slip-ons, kind of like Vans. Um, they just slip on, but they have like a white, um, what do you call that? Like not macrame, not lace, but like a kind of a lacy looking texture to it. These are in size four and they were $14.99. This is kind of like her size right now. I mean, it technically is probably a little big for her feet right now like yeah they're a little bit big for her feet right now but i wouldn't be buying anything smaller than this because that would just be like a total waste so i ended up getting these cat and jack sandals in a size five because they did not have anything in a size four so i'm just like she can grow into these this will probably be her size, you know, later on in the summer, so it'll be fine. She'll grow into them, and they're just so cute. I couldn't pass them up. So yeah, I got these in a size 5 because they just did not have anything smaller, and I just couldn't resist them. They're so cute. They're like a dark coral color, and they have gold hardware on it, and they have like a braided detail. They're just like, I would wear these shoes. If they were in my size, I would probably wear these, and I just couldn't pass them up. They they were $18.99. Okay, a little bit of a position change. Moving on to the clothes that I got from Target, I did get quite a few things. I got these little soft shorts. I got all the clothes in size 
12 months so technically a little bit big for her now but you know that's basically her size right now so these are like just little soft shorts they're gray with like a multicolored band and they're just like stretchy soft comfy and then another comfy pair in mint of course and these kind of have like a little detail going down the side they're kind of like little athletic shorts kind of and now Zaya is here reaching for the camera look at her you don't want to be in your high chair for the for the haul, let's try the crib. Crib didn't work because she was making a fuss. Okay, what if I hold you? Didn't want me to hold you, wanted me to put you down. Now you're pulling my hair out. So now we're on the floor and she wants to reach for the camera and open up everything and play with everything. I don't know y'all, how are we gonna do this? So then they had like these little t-shirts, this has ice cream cones on it, really cute, and little bows on the sleeve, I don't know if you can see that, and it has a matching pair of leggings that are the exact same fabric, so she can wear this together or you know, mix and match. On clearance, they had this on clearance for $8.90, no $8.38, and it's like a little denim shirt with cuffed sleeves and pockets on the front just super cute super cute if you guys can't tell i love baby clothes that are basically like not baby clothes but just like miniature clothes i don't really like like super frilly frou-frou ruffles baby fied type of clothes like because i feel like it's uncomfortable for them to have all those like ruffles and bows and like unnecessary amounts of lace and stuff so i like to just get like more i guess modern type stuff like this then we got two pajama sets so this one says milkshakes are better with mommy so this theme for the set is piggies with milkshakes and i thought it was really cute and so there's two shirts and two pants that go with it so this one has a different print on it and then there's these little legging pants one with polka dots and one with piggies so you can mix and match these and these are i guess supposed to be pajamas but I don't even know. Maybe they're not even supposed to be pajamas. Um, well, it is. It's the flame resistant material that is like meant for pajamas. So I guess they are. Zaya. No. <laughs> you see what she does when she gets in trouble? She gives me a hug. When I say no, she's like, oh. So yeah, this is the appropriate pajama fabric, <laughs> but um, it kind of looks, I mean, like depending on, you know, they can wear it for real clothes too. Um, and this one says, it's past your bedtime. Pasture, cow pasture, get it? So it has this one with the cow on it and then this one with a bunch of cows on it and then two little leggings, one that matches the top and then one that is just a cow print. And then I got a couple of little like big girl cute outfits where they're more like, I don't know, like fancier a little bit. So this one's like a cute little tunic with bell sleeves. <laughs> and it's got like, it's almost like a, a chambray like denim with like this floral embroidery. Really, really cute. Once again, I would wear this if this was my size. And it came with like little mustard yellow leggings underneath it. And then this little dress, which once again, I would wear this. It's a really pretty like peacock pattern. And it's just like a really pretty color scheme. It's just a simple little shift dress and it has a little gold zipper in the back to put it on. And then from that same collection, I got this little romper. It has like a ruffle going across the top. <laughs> and it has little shorts. And the shorts have little pockets and it's a really pretty print. Once again, it kind of matches with that uh, peacock dress. And I just thought this was really pretty and I would wear it if it was my size. So this one was $17.99. The peacock dress was $17.99 and the uh, romper was $14.99. Zaya's already digging into the Carter's bag. So Carter's was actually having a sale. They were having like 40% off of a lot of stuff. Here you go. Say thank you. <laughs> that thirsty mama, leave me alone. 
So I did get two more pairs of shoes. They had a little bit of a better shoe selection in terms of her actual size. Um, so I got these little flip flops. They're like literally flip flops with a little extra strap to help them stay on. And they're pink with the pineapples on it if it'll focus. So that's just, I just, I can't like that. So freaking cute. I don't know how like practical this really is but they had her size and they're so freaking cute with the pineapples and i thought it went with some of her summary stuff that i got from target so i got those and then as more of a practical shoe a substantial shoe what is that from i don't even know what that's from but anyway this one is from what are you doing you're taking the socks i need those socks <laughs> um this one is silver glitter so real shiny and glittery and it has like pink on the inside and these are like super easy just like velcro on one side and I like these type of flats I didn't get the other pink ones because they were more of just a slip-on type of flat I like these that actually have some sort of ankle strap that way they stay on her feet a lot better um, so I thought these were just like a cute little neutral silver she can wear with like all of her outfits and these are 9 to 12 months size and I think, I don't know, the pricing on here is a little bit, where'd my receipt go? These came out to be $12 and the flip flops came out to be $5. Then I just got a three pack of socks, white, black, and pink. These ones have the little ankle ruffles on it, which she actually has not had these ones before. These are in three to 12 months size. Then I got this little kind of, it's like a mix between neon and pastel, uh, blue, green, yellow, orange, and pink, just plain onesies with white polka dots on it. Then I just got this little white dress with blue palm trees on it and little pink trim, just really simple. Also comes with just little plain, white bloomers inside of there has a little drawstring around the wind just something really comfy and easy for her to wear with her flip-flops I guess <laughs> have uh, pineapples and palm trees and um, this was like nine dollars and the last thing that I got is just these little polka dot white leggings with colorful polka dot leggings and I thought that that would pair nicely with any of her polka dot onesies so these can kind of go together so yeah, that was everything. I know that was kind of a lot and this was like the most hectic haul I've ever filmed in my life. But basically a lot of white and neon summery colors and just lots of comfy soft stuff that's easy to wear and comfy to wear and going to be good for the warmer weather coming up. And got some shoes. Yay, we got some shoes now, finally, because she's only really been wearing her Vans and her fuzzy boots. And it's about time to not be wearing fuzzy boots anymore. So I'm glad that she got some other shoes. But yeah, I feel like this uh, shopping vlog was a lot more like hectic and in shambles compared to the other one. She was a lot more calm in the last vlog, but that just shows you. It just depends on her mood. It just de pins right now she's like I'm ready to go I'm up and ready to go so sorry for all of the excess noise and craziness in this vlog but that's just real life this is just 100% real life unplanned just trying to film in the moment so that's just how it goes so it's later on now Zaya is all ready for bed and she's wearing one of her new milkshake piggy pajama sets so it's a little t-shirt with little matching pants and it's so cute and it fits her can you believe you wear 12 month size clothes now Zaya that's crazy night night boo boo